que ingresó. Oh my God. I'm very sorry, guys. I really don't know what to say. I'm so sorry. I've been trying to, I, I mean, I, I even call incluso llamelos de administración porque en realidad no sé qué es lo que sucede con ustedes, chicos. No sé si no quiere que les dé la clase. I really don't know. So I don't know. Is the universe telling me something? I don't know. Well, so we're going to continue with what I was saying. And once again, I'm so sorry for this inconvenience that we're having right now. I mean, it's not my intention to, to do that, but you know, it's like some things that we cannot control uh, that out of my hands. So uh, what I was saying in this part, guys, is that this is pretty much the basic thing or the most easiest form in a question. For example, a este tipo de preguntas les llamamos, uh, les llamamos a yes or no question. So I can see that Jonathan is asking a question. No, on Wednesday, we do not have class. El día miércoles no tenemos clase, chicos. So of course, it is a day off because we have Memorials Day. Tenemos el día de los, de los difuntos, Memorials Day. So we don't have class. So the class that we supposed to have on Wednesday, la clase que se supone que tenemos el día miércoles, la vamos a pasar para el día viernes. So it means que el día viernes tendríamos esa clase. And, porque sería nuestra última clase, recuerdan que desde la semana pasada dije que tenemos examen. Correct. Sí, así que todos listos para el día viernes porque tenemos examen de todo lo que hemos visto en el modo. So I need everyone to be ready for that. Now, as I was saying, como les estaba diciendo, este tipo de preguntas son yes or no questions. Why? For example, si yo le pregunto, let's see, are you speaking? Are you speaking? Estás hablando? Are you speaking? What are you going to say? Vas a decir? Yes, I am. For example, las formas cortas de responder son yes or no. Yes, I am. Or you can say no, I am not. No. So that's what we have. Now, for example, if I ask, let me see. If I ask, let's see, we have uh, Axel. Are you there, Axel? Axel? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Now, if I ask you the question, Axel, is she eating? What would you say? ¿Qué diría si te pregunto? Is she eating? Uh, oh, he is not. He isn't. He isn't? Yes, he is. No, no, yes. I I didn't say he. Me preguntaría cómo. Listen to the question. La pregunta es, is she eating? Ah, okay. Entonces sería, yes. Yes, she eating. Mm. Remember, in that case, porque son preguntas de sí o no, solamente utilizamos el verb to be. No decimos el verbo. So if I ask you, is she okay. eating? Mm -hmm. What would you say? ¿Qué dirías then? Yes. Yes. Yes, I am. No. no yes, I am. am. Someone has an idea. Alguien tiene una idea. Si le pregunto, is she eating? 
¿Cómo responderíamos? Yo prefiero. Ok. Eh, yes, she is. Yes, she is. Or no, she isn't. That is correct. No, that is the way isn't. we would say. Esa es la forma en la que responderíamos. Yes, she is. Or no, she isn't. According to the action. Dependiendo la acción que la persona esté haciendo. Now, I think that that's really easy. Esta forma está más fácil. So we're going to move. Is there any question? Hay alguna pregunta que alguien tenga so far? No. Profe, y en um, cuando se responde, por ejemplo, yes I do. Yes I do. ¿En qué varía con yes I am? No, en este caso yes I do no ese es otro tipo. Mm -hmm. en, y en this one estamos hablando del uh, present continuous. Estamos hablando del presente continuo. Por eso es que respondemos, yes, I am, or yes, you are, or yes, he is, because estamos utilizando el verbo to be como auxiliar. Y en el caso que tú me dijiste, el do, ahí el do es el auxiliar. Mm -hmm. So, uh, if there's no any other question regarding to yes. We're going to move on. Nos vamos a mover a la siguiente parte. Yes, I have a question, teacher. Uh -huh. What's your question? I have a question. Mm -hmm. eh, por ejemplo, eh, puedo utilizar, eh, de, puedo preguntar, you are, eh, study? Are you? No, o, nunca va a ser. Tiene que ser, are you study? Exactly. Nunca vamos a decir you are studying. Eh, pero les voy, a, les voy a explicar esto. Ok, en Estados Unidos, si yo digo you are studying, si yo hago la entonación de pregunta, por ejemplo, you are studying, estás estudiando, ellos me lo van a entender como pregunta. Y para ellos... En lenguaje coloquial o lenguaje callejero, eso estaría correcto. Pero si hablamos en, en gramaticalmente hablando, en lenguaje profesional, eso está incorrecto. Mas no significa que si tú a un americano le dices, you are studying, con entonación. Esa es la diferencia. Entonación de pregunta, ellos te van a entender que tú le estás uh -huh. preguntando si está estudiando. Exactly. Pero para un examen nunca lo debes poner. Okay. En un examen te lo van a pedir gramaticalmente correcto. Y lo Ajá. que tú acabas de preguntarme está incorrecto gramaticalmente, Ajá. pero correcto en la forma de hablar coloquial o en las calles. Ajá, porque como se dice, por ejemplo, en el primero, am, am, a, o sea, podemos preguntar como I am o am, a, por eso me confundí en esta parte. No, but, but that's a Entonces, good question, esa es una buena pregunta. Lo mismo era para lo demás. No, eh, eh, tienes que, que saber que eso, viendo okay. la entonación, eso va a ser en lenguaje callejero, estaría bien, más en lenguaje pedagógico o profesional o gramaticalmente hablando estaría incorrecto así que la forma correcta gramaticalmente es esta am I, are you is he, is she and so on mm, ok All thank right. you teacher no thank you, gracias a ti por preguntar so now we're gonna move on, nos vamos a mover en here, aquí tenemos los tipos de respuesta Yes or no. Here we have interrogatives. Las interrogantes. Am I painting? Estoy pintando. Are you eating? Is he swimming? Is she walking? It is painting. Are we eating? And so on. So we can say, yes, I am. Or no, I am not. Or la contraction or la contracción, no, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, you aren't. Or no, you are not. 
Okay, so Adelia, let me listen to you, Adelia. Tell me reading the yes and no. The contractions y las contracciones en las negativas, please. So let's go. Sería, yes, I am. Mm -hmm. No, no, I'm not. Okay. You, sería, yes, you are. Mm -hmm. No, you, you aren't. You aren't, okay. Sería, uh, he, yes, he is. Mm -hmm. No, he isn't. Okay. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. No, no, it isn't. Okay. Yes, we are. Yes. No, no we we are. Mm -hmm. Yes, you are. No, you are. Okay. And yes, they are. No, they aren't. Okay, good. Thank you very much. Now, any questions so far? Preguntas acerca de eso? I guess this is clear, right? Con esta forma de acá podemos ver un poco más claro, but does any one of you have any question? Alguien tiene alguna pregunta so far? Well, okay. So, here we have, this is the other form. Esa es la otra forma de hacer preguntas. What is the difference? Now we are using a WH question. Ahora estamos utilizando una WH question al inicio. ¿Cuáles son esas? Who. What is who? ¿Qué es who? ¿Quién? ¿Quién? What is what? Yeah. Okay. What is when? Cuando. What is where? Donde. Donde o What is why? Por qué. Por qué. And how? Como. Como. Exactly. De pregunta. Remember, la pronunciación de esta, por favor, que no se les vaya a olvidar. Creo que ya se las había dicho anteriormente. Ok, so, do not make, no hay que hacer, no hay que cometer el error en esa pronunciación. So, please. Now, the difference, la diferencia entre las questions, the previous questions, las anteriores y estas, is that, Solamente estamos utilizando una WH question at the beginning, al inicio, lo que significa que yo respondo corto o largo. Largo. Why? ¿Por qué, Carlos Rodríguez? Porque Because it's an open question. It is an open question, correct. I think that. Está abierta. So it is not a yes and no. So si alguien me pregunta, who are you speaking? Or why are you speaking? Si alguien le pregunta, why are you speaking? Usted no le va a decir yes. Yes, I am, right? No, that's not. No respondemos de esa manera because it's not logical. No es lógico. So, when someone asks you the question, why are you speaking? Si yo les hago esa pregunta, why are you speaking? Necesito que todos me den una respuesta a esa pregunta en el chat de la llamada. Why are you speaking? Why are you speaking? Y se las voy a escribir en el chat. Why are you speaking? Please give an answer to that.
Okay, I got Umberto's answer. He says, because I can't, he says. Because I like to talk, okay? Because you ask our... Hmm. Because I do, I do not stop because I'm practice my speaking skills, okay? Oh, that's nice. Cada uno ha dado una respuesta completamente diferente. That's good. All right, I'm, I'm still missing some people. So I just got Jonathan Alberto, I got Adelia, I got Elizabeth, I got Marielos, I got Carlos Rodriguez, and Humberto Bonilla. What about the others? ¿Qué hay de los demás? I'm still missing some people right here. Elizabeth, I already got Elizabeth. Oh, okay. Well, so probably the okay Edwin Polanco because I learned well Giselle because I do not cooking. Okay, Sumara because I love. Okay, good. Now let me tell you something, guys. El lenguaje de las calles o el mal llamado lenguaje callejero, la forma en la que ustedes me han respondido estaría. Perfecta, perfect. Pero en un lenguaje profesional o gramaticalmente correcto, usted me tendría que responder si yo le pregunto why are you speaking? Usted me va a responder I am speaking because bla bla bla. ¿Sí? De la manera en la que todos me lo han respondido es que de una sola vez me dieron el because. And that's fine. No les estoy diciendo que esté incorrecto. That's okay. ¿Sí? Porque en lenguaje hablado o en lenguaje de calle, si alguien le hace esa pregunta, you're speaking? De una sola vez, usted responde because it's difficult, because it's important, because blah, blah, blah. But... Si en un examen usted pone una respuesta como esa, automáticamente tiene medio punto. ¿Por qué? Usted no me está respondiendo de una manera gramaticalmente correcta. Que sería, I am speaking because bla, bla, bla. Si ¿Sí me entienden la diferencia, chicos? Do you guys understand that? Yes, teacher. Yes, Good. Yes. So, espero que todos me lo entiendan, porque si de repente llegan a hacer un examen así, no vayan a cometer un error. El lenguaje hablado, usted dígalo de esa manera. Ok, usted puede decir, because, bla, bla, bla. But in an exam, en un examen, no, don't do that. No van a hacer de esa manera si no quiere que le vayan bajando los puntos, ok? Porque eh, sería, sería incorrectamente gramatical. No estaría bien. Grammatically incorrect. Now, any question, alguna pregunta so far? So far, so good. Todo bien hasta el momento. So far, so good. Well, we hope so. So, espero que el viernes, ¿verdad? En todo en esto, yes, todos. No questions, no mistake, nothing. So let's see. In questions, guys, podemos contractar cuando hacemos preguntas el verbo to be, que es un auxiliar más la WH question. For example, who is is equals to, es igual a whose. What is is equal to what's. Where is is equal to where's. When is is equals to when's. Why is is equals to why's. And how is is equals to how's. Now, let me listen to everyone. Todos me van a hacer estas pronunciaciones. Empezamos con Marielos. Marielos, let's go with you. Okay, who is who's? What is what's? Okay. Where is where's? Okay. When is when's? Mm -hmm. 
why is twice how is house okay thank you very much oscar let's go with you oscar okay who is whose what is what where is where's why is why is how is how's Okay, good. Let's see. Now let's go with Carlos Rodriguez. Let's go with you. Carlos Rodriguez. Sorry, 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 sorry. Is who is equal who's? What is equal what's? Where is equal where's? When is equal when's? Why is equal why's? Mm -hmm. How is equal how's? Humberto, are you there? Humberto? Who is who's? Mm -hmm. Listen? Yes. Uh, what is what? S. Where is where? Okay, here, make this strong. I when el sonido de la S fuerte, please. Once again, de la S, yes. What is what? Okay, where is where's? Okay, when is when's? Okay. Why is wise? I am scary. <laughs> Go ahead. How is how? No, no, no. No how. How. It's okay? How. Okay. <laughs> how is house? Okay, be careful, please. Be careful there. Now, Adelia, we go with you. <laughs> okay. Thank you, teacher. Adelia, we'll go with you. Who is who's? What is what? Where is where's? When is when's? Why is why's? How is how's? Repeat this one again. Um, how is? Ah, okay. Okay. House. Yes, all right. Uh, let's see, Jacqueline. Jacqueline? Hello, you, Jacqueline. Well, she's not there, probably. Now, Julissa, are you there? Julissa. Well, she's not there either. Elizabeth, you there? Hi, teacher. Who is that? Hi, teacher. Yes. Oh, Jacqueline, okay. <laughs> Jacqueline, we go with you, Jacqueline, and then we go with Elizabeth. Who is? Who's? Okay. Okay. Eh, todos. Yes, all Where of is? them. What? Okay. Where's? Where is? Where's? Okay. When is? When's? Mm -hmm. Why, why is wise? Mm -hmm. Who is whose? Mm, say it again. How is how? How is, okay, good. 
Now, we're going to go to a small practice, guys. Yes. Nos vamos a mover a una práctica muy rápida because of the time. So, let me show you what we're going to do. Déjenme mostrarle lo que vamos a hacer. And... Okay. Here we have, we're going to have this practice that is going to be really fast. So just let me move to that part. And let me show it to you. Let's see. Can you see it on your screens? Lo pueden ver en sus pantallas? You let me know. Can you see it or not? Yes. Oh. yes. Yes. Okay, good. So we have those eight sentences. Ocho oraciones. What I need you to do, lo que necesito que hagan, is only verify if it is a question, verify if it is positive, verify if it is negative. Okay? Take a screenshot, please. Tome una captura de pantalla y lo vamos a ir a hacer rapidito a los breakout rooms. We're going to work that on teams. That's the only thing that we're going to do. So you let me know so I can stop sharing. Are you ready? Well, I'm going to take that as a yes. So yes. Yes. All right, so we're going to go to the breakout rooms, guys, and I need everyone to go right now.
All right. So guys, did you finish the exercises? Did you finish it or no? Yes. You did? Okay, great. So we're just going to wait for the others to join the main session because I see that some of them are still in the groups. So we're just going to wait for them to come back. Okay. All right. So I see that now they are coming back. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Jacqueline, what is the answer, Jacqueline, for number one? Um, you are using my mobile phone? Correct. You are using my mobile phone. Adelia, what is the answer for number two? My my dad is washing his car. Correct. Now, Axel, what is the answer for number three? It's not raining today. Mm. Nos falta algo ahí, Axel. No, no, nothing raining. No. No. El auxiliar. ¿Cuál es el auxiliar? Axel? Sería Don. No. No. What is the auxiliar, Axel? ¿Cuál es el auxiliar en el presente continuo, chicos? The verb to be. The verb is. to be. So, Axel? It's not raining. Mm, it no. is not it raining. It's raining today. Uh -huh, okay, so pay attention to that, Axel. Now, let's okay. Oscar, what is the answer of number four, Oscar? I, I cannot listen to you, Oscar. I see that you're speaking, but... Oh, 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 okay, 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 okay. Hmm? Who, who is she sharing to now? Exactly. Who is she sharing or chatting to now? Good. Number five, Marielos, what is the answer of number five? Uh, what, what are you doing at the moment? Correct. What are you doing at the moment? Let me see. Uh, Elizabeth Rivas, what is the answer for number six? We are on the train. Mm, we are on the train in the verb. ¿Y el verbo qué pasó ahí? No la terminamos. We are sitting on the train, okay? So we're going to stop there, guys. Um, thank you so much. Muchas gracias, chicos, a todos for being so responsible and for always staying here, even though when I have some situations with the with my internet. So, Marielos, I'm going to try to resolve the, the issue uh, tomorrow, okay? So I will let you know in case we need uh we i have an information okay i will text sí. Gracias, profe. all right so thank you everyone for being here on the on the session of today i wish you have a good night and hope to see you guys tomorrow at the same time okay have a good night yeah. okay. bye bye, bye. 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 bye.